It has been now three days since the extraordinary delivery of my patient, and I just wanted to update you that her recovery is progressing extremely well. She's in very stable condition. She has been walking about and has been able to visit her eight newborns in the neonatal intensive care unit um, on several occasions. I just want to uh, mention a few things. Our patient came to us uh, in the first trimester of pregnancy from an outside provider. Our patient was counseled regarding her options for the pregnancy. The options were to continue the pregnancy or to selectively abort. The patient chose to continue the pregnancy. We as physicians, our goal is to provide the best possible care for our patients, no matter what the situation or circumstances are. Our patient proved to be an outstanding individual. She was willing to do whatever was necessary to get the best possible outcome. And thus far, according to the report from Dr. Gupta, the kids are really doing well. Uh, all eight babies, they are doing good. Um, they continue to get better uh, every day. Um, Seven of them are breathing on their own and do not require any oxygen. Only one baby still requires just a very small amount of oxygen, which we think we would be able to take off probably tomorrow. Uh, seven of the babies are feeding right now, even though very small amounts. And uh, only one baby, we have not started feeding yet, and we would start that feeding tomorrow. Uh, all the babies, they are getting uh, extra intravenous nutrition support, which we continue uh, for a few days as the babies progress and as the babies eat better uh, and digest better, we would increase the feedings and uh, continue to go down or decrease the amount of intravenous support. Uh, they are acting very good. They are very feisty. They have very uh, beautiful cries. And uh, when the mom visits them and mom touches them, they respond adequately. They respond really good for 31 weeks uh, premature babies.